My mother didn't believe in elves, fairies, or dragons. George? But she did believe in the devil. And she did not view him as an appropriate playmate for her son. George? All right, the other one was funny. Now you're just being a jackass. <laughs> I'm glad you're both amused. But our little boy's soul may be at stake. Come on. When I was a kid, we were listening to Black Sabbath, all that devil music. Didn't hurt. The game contains demonology, which goes against the teachings of the church. But nobody's touching nothing, right? No. Well, then I don't quite know what you're worried about. You don't? Nope. I'm just thankful Billy found some friends and he ain't eating dirt and crabgrass anymore. It's the smart boy. You are lucky. To have a smart son is a great joy. I do not have that joy. Oh, I'm sure that's not true. Listen, are you aware that Tam and Sheldon are playing Dungeons and Dragons? I agree with you. I will talk to Tam. Oh, good. Thank you. Uh, well, bye. Nice meeting you. Five dollars? Anyway, I'm sorry to drag you into this, but it is demon, so it's in your purview. It is indeed. In fact, at a recent Young Baptist Leaders Conference, I attended a seminar on satanic leisure activities. And? And the important lesson. Yes, sir? Well, let me ask you a question. You say you don't believe in God, but what kind of scientist comes to a conclusion without first doing the research? A bad scientist. That's right. So I'll see you Sunday morning at 8 o'clock. No, you No, there's no Amalex. Told ya. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For God. And the word was God. Well done. Thank you. I read the Gospels last night. Suck up. Did you know when the Bible says the word, they're translating the Greek expression logos, and logos means knowledge. What? Shelly, I'm so happy you're taking an interest in religion. I am. And I've decided to explore other religions, too. What's his name? Pastor Jeff encouraged me to approach religion scientifically so it only makes sense. Jesus, God, and Mary. Jesus isn't God? No, he's his son. But you do eat him and drink his blood. Oh, there's also a ghost, but not the scary kind. Like Casper? Exactly. Unless you're a woman, then you have to go to your husband's planet. But that won't be a problem for me. I don't have a husband. All I have is a cat, a big, mean cat. Maybe I'll... You hungry? You want a nosh? I don't know. I've never eaten a nosh. Uh, no, a uh, nosh is not a thing. It's a... Uh, never mind. Um, would you care for some hard candy? Are they kosher? Who are you, my mother? <laughs> it's a... Probably. Then I strongly advise you to stay Baptist. Maybe even wear a cross. Why did you move to Texas? Well, that's simple. Medford had no Jews, so there was an opening for one. That's okay. I have the book about it. Would you be angry with me if I don't pick your religion? I could never be angry with you. You be a C one and zero. We are the binary code that underlies the universe. The ten thing is a common mistake. I want to understand God. Can you help me? Did you not hear what we just said? Oh, Zero was about to tell me the secret and you ruined it. I never heard from one and zero again. Although I was once visited by nine when I had chicken pox. He was a lot less funny than he thought he was. Everybody. Any takers? Okay. Let's go have a talk with your mom. The only sin in mythology is being stupid. Welcome to the Church of Math.